This damn Garmin. On our recent ride home from Nashville and Wingding 41, we were enjoying a beautiful ride from Nashville to Memphis when all of a sudden my Garmin GPS put us off onto a dirt road. I'm on a 2018 Goldwing pulling a trailer and a passenger. This, this damn Garmin. So for those of you that are watching this, this is where my Garmin sent me. We're on a dirt road. I got Ricky back here. I got my trailer. And I told Garmin, no unpaved roads. It's supposed to avoid unpaved roads. Does this look like a paved road to you, Garmin? So we're going about 10 miles an hour, 11 miles an hour. It's not bad. It's not gravelly or anything. It's not, thank God, it's not wet or muddy. But it's real narrow. And it looks like it goes back here to some private homes and stuff off the road. And the GPS shows, you know, curving around and finally hitting a highway or something. But why would it put me on this little road? Yeah, it's not a road. I don't even know. It, it had a name. <laughs> so it must have been a road. Oh, there's a little piece of concrete. And it, it, and it looks like you're going to get a, and, you know, if I start hearing banjo music, I'm going to freak out. Or there's going to be a steep incline like the one coming up and I'm not sure if I can this is going to be this is going to be real interesting hope there's not a car coming the other way wow this is this is really interesting I I've never done this before now I'm climbing it now we're climbing a hill. And it's not very smooth. Damn Garmin. And there obviously is no place to turn around. I've got one and a half miles more to go before we get, hopefully, to something better than this. Well. I didn't plan on doing off-roading with my 2018 Goldwing. What worries me is where what the next road it's going to put me on because it's called Beaver Dam Road. God, that name sounds familiar in a bad way. Now I know how Nora Lee on Itchy Boots feels when she's out in the middle of nowhere, except she has a dirt bike or an adventure bike.
this happens every time I use the Garmin. I end up on one of these paths. Now we're getting into some rocks and gravel. Thank God it's relatively smooth. And probably. But I, I don't know what I don't know what Beaver Dam Road is. That worries me. That doesn't sound like anything better than this. I'm just hoping it's paved. We're seven tenths of a mile from Beaver Dam Road. Uh, this is going to be a separate YouTube video. I'm just going to make a separate YouTube video just about this little jaunt. We got off Highway 100, which is a beautiful, smooth, paved highway, and we ended up on this. And I and I programmed this through Basecamp, which I, in my routing preferences, I say avoid unpaved roads. And in my Garmin 595 I have it programmed to avoid maybe maybe avoid doesn't mean completely ignore I don't know but I don't know why it would put me on a dirt road okay I'm coming up on Beaver Dam Road so I'm not sure what that was all about That's, oh God, I think this is Beaver Dam Road. You, no, not yet. Four, four tenths of a mile. Still got a half a mile to go. Thank God there's no traffic. Yeah, this is when Ricky could really use some uh, passenger grab rails and with this 2018, there really aren't any. Okay, now we get to go down a hill. This is gonna be fun. We have to keep speed up. It's very rocky. I hope there's nobody coming. Very technical for a Goldwing to go through this. This is not easy because the rocks want to turn that front tire. This is probably the most challenging thing I've ever done on a motorcycle. Pulling a trailer with a passenger going down a steep grade on a dirt road. And we have a fairly tight bend coming up here. Wow, that was fun. We're one-tenth of a mile from Beaver Dam Road. I hope to God it's not a trail like this. It looks, looks promising. It looks like maybe pavement. There is a stop sign. That's a good sign, I guess. Wow. At least I see pavement. I have to go right. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. Okay. That was the most challenging thing I've ever done on two wheels. And I don't... No, we're not finished yet. Because now we have to go through this little gravel patch to get on the highway, but fortunately there's no traffic, so I don't think it's going to be an issue. And I don't know what that was all about. Yeah, and I think we're backtracking. It seems like we're going back the same way we were coming before. But anyway, that's the end of the adventure, I hope. Woo! Man. Cruise Man's first off-road Goldwing video pulling a trailer and a passenger. Well, after our little adventure on the dirt road, we're now back on a highway 
and uh, the Garmin wanted me to turn onto another dirt road. <clears throat> but I could tell by the name of the road I wasn't going to turn on. It was called Backside Beaver Dam Road. You don't ever want to go on Backside Beaver Dam Road. I don't care what you're driving. So we stayed on this highway. This is uh, Highway 438. And apparently the Garmin is rerouting us using this highway. It's a beautiful little road, beautiful scenery. So I will say one thing. Every highway we've been on have been really uh, nice pavement. This is, looks brand new. So we are on Highway 438. I want to record this so that, uh, you know, someday when someone discovers the gold wing and the two skeletons, They'll know what we went through and where we ended up and how we ended up there. But man, I'll tell you, that, that was the most challenging thing I think I've ever done on a motorcycle. I've been on tougher roads. I've done uh, more challenging uh, roads than that on a motorcycle, but not on a Goldwing. I was on a dirt bike. And man, I'll tell you, a couple of those grades were pretty steep with tight turns, rocks, dirt. Ah, <laughs> uh, tell you what, I that was that was challenging. I feel like I earned my money for today. So give me a thumbs up, Ricky. Yeah, see, somebody appreciates me. See what I go through for you YouTube viewers? Goldwing, I'm going to start a Goldwing off-road channel. I'm going to put some knobby tires on this sucker. And I'll just program the Garmin and tell it to avoid unpaved roads and just see where the hell it takes me. And you, you will all be along for the ride, for the adventure. This is a pretty beautiful ride right here. This is a really nice little road. Can't go real fast on it, but it's a pretty road. I guess it's just all in the adventure. I don't know. Hey everybody, enjoyed making this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on the little bell icon if you want notification of future videos. Thanks for joining us today on Cruise Man's Motovlog. Hey, this is a twisty little road here.